Today we're gonna be unboxing a $60 Spats Pops mystery box. I'm also gonna be starting a new giveaway. What's going on, guys? This is Joe with Don't Pop Leave and welcome to the channel. Today I'm gonna be unboxing a $60 Spats Pops mystery box. There's a few different Freddies in there. There's like Freddy Vault Boy, Freddy Steve, and then like another Freddy. So there's three different ones that are the top prizes. I believe it was limited to 50 boxes. So I have a decent chance of pulling one of those cool ones. So I'm gonna open it up, skin the pops at the end, and then see how I did. So we're hoping for that hard stack. All right, so we're opening it. I'm gonna show you guys and then I'll try not to look here. So I can't see if there's a hard stack there. I don't even know if I'm showing the camera right. All right, so I'll put that down. I can't get this bubble wrap off. All right, all right. Oh, cool. Okay, so it's in a... I was wondering why I felt something hard. It's, it's not a hard stack, but it's a, like a cardboard-like box. Alright, so our first pop is... If I can grab it. First pop is... Vanna White from Wheel of Fortune. I like watching the videos of the people that go to solve the puzzle, and it's like way off. Uh, those are hysterical. Uh, so this is going to be for trade or mystery boxes in the future. All right, so the next pop I have is... What we got here? Ooh, Goku. Ultra Instinct. Uh, Dragon Ball. I never really got into like any animes, but if I did get into one, it would probably be like Dragon Ball Z or like Naruto. Uh, so that's actually a really cool pop. The hair is really cool on it, like the silver hair. So yeah, not a, not a bad pop for sure. Uh, he does have a lot of damage on him. That's unfortunate. You guys can see that on the back there. We got... Oh, that's cool. It's the Diamond Collection, Carmen San Diego. This is the Emerald City... Yep, the Emerald City Comic Con 2019 exclusive. Really cool pop. I have one similar to this, but it's a, a different sticker. Alright, and then the last box we have... We have... What is this guy? Oh, nice. I just pulled one of these. It is... Battle Armor Skeletor. I actually just pulled this in one of my other mystery boxes from Spatsy Pops. Uh, so yeah, actually this is looking like a pretty solid box. I think between this and Carmen San Diego, I got close to my money back, and then plus the other two pops. So yeah, it looks uh, pretty solid so far. All right, I'm gonna start with Vanna White to find out what the prices were on these guys. She is worth, she's worth unknown. I think she's probably brand new, that's probably why. I would say like seven to 10 for this. Alright, so I looked her up on PPG and she's worth $7, uh, so right around where I thought she would be. Alright, so Goku comes in around $10 uh, with the damage. I'd probably knock it down to like 6 or 7 just because that is a quite a bit of damage on here. Got the Carmen San Diego. This one is $22. It's a really cool pop. If you guys don't have this one, uh, it's really cool. Like the diamond ones, they're really cool to collect. Got the Battle Armor Skeletor. I think he was like $31 or $34 or something like that uh, like a week ago. He's coming in at $31. So yeah, $31, $22. So we're sitting at $53, $60 plus like another $6. So we got like $65, $67 worth of value. Um, so just over what I paid for. I uh, got two really cool pops out of it. So I uh, call that a win. So nothing for my personal collection, but I will be using these for trades or selling them as well to try to get something for my personal collection. So I'm also going to be doing a giveaway. It is for the Mike Stranger Things Funko Pop. I still haven't watched uh, anything past the first episode. I am behind on a few other TV shows as well, like The Big Bang Theory, The 100. So I'm going to be watching those first, and then this will probably be next. So make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and then put down in the comments uh, if you've ever been to like a Comic Con. And if you have, uh, what kind of celebrity or person did you meet there? Um, was it from your favorite TV show, favorite movie? Uh, just let me know, and then you'll be entered to win. When I thought about going to the New York Comic Con, uh, the hotels and everything just makes it where it's not worth it, really. I like going to the Comic Cons around, like, the Chicago and, like, Midwest area. Uh, there's some actually pretty cool Comic Cons there. Uh, so, yeah, just let me know. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and best of luck to everyone.